Peak Freaks, it's Monday! Monday with Coach Eva boxing sessions. I know that so many of you want to punch. Yes, we all want to punch. How you could not want to punch? What an amazing energy is being released by punches. So join me today. I am giving you a moment to log in because exactly on time at 5.15 p.m. New York time, we are starting this session. Get ready, have your stretch band with you so we can stretch and foam roll together. If you have a foam roller, if you do not, make sure you purchase someone because one foam roller, just a regular one, it's going to be a great tool for your stretching. Remember, it's a myofascial release. It's going to help you to break down the tight muscles that happened throughout the sessions. So this is very important. And what else you need for today's session? Obviously, if you have a bag, that's great. If you do not have a bag, don't worry. You can do um, body weight or light dumbbells two to three pounds. And of course, a band. band. My bands are at the pole. My bands are already right here set up. So you have a minute to adjust your band and let's do this. I'm actually gonna get additional band. If you have a lighter and heavier, get both because they both can be used. Now, one of the bands should be installed lower, literally low, 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 low. And the other one should be like your, probably somewhere around your hip level, chest level. And that's how I'm going to start today. All right, who is with me? You hear my voice? I am here. I didn't go anywhere. I'm right here. Just make sure that your bands are installed because we're going to be doing this crazy stuff today. I'm going to teach you some cool moves. If you haven't boxed with me, you're going to learn some cool moves today. And yes, we are about to start, my friends. What time is it? It's a minute, minute. We have one minute. So what's in your pre-workout? It's very important to make sure that you have your pre-workout, that you have your BCAA, that you have your beverage mix. And if you're wondering, if you've been trying to get a beverage mix, it's going to be available on December 22nd. But always stuck up. This is number one seller from Herbalife. It's the best and it's nothing comparable to the market on the market right now. It's that gives you that fullness that you cannot get it with any other protein, especially before the workout. So what's in your pre-workout? What is it? Write it down, answer, send me a message if you need to create your own concoction and let's do this. I already had my pre-workout this morning when I did my first session. Right now, this is my second session. And what's in my pre-workout? It's literally the herbal tea concentrate and it's good enough. It's gonna give you amazing energy but this is my second, so I don't need a second pre workout. We are starting. Let's sip. Let's do this. You're going to have you're going to have some time to sit throughout the session. Okay, my friends, we're starting with foam rolling. We are starting with foam rolling. We're gonna foam roll the quads. We are going to foam roll the quads. So make sure you're getting a foam roller. This one has spikes. And this is an advanced foam roll. So if you're looking to start, you never foam roll. The white or blue color should be fine. However, nowadays there's so many different colors available. So look for the low density one, okay? Don't look for the super hard one. Don't look for the spiky one. Just try a little lighter density. And you don't need to have a very long one like I have. You can have a short version that is quick and easy, portable. You can take it anywhere with you on vacation. Yes. All right, let's do the sides. Now we're gonna bring legs sideways. Now, this is very painful for me because this has the spikes. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna bring one leg over just like this so I can actually lift that pressure of that leg by bringing this leg over and I still have a little bit more control over the foam roller. Otherwise, what's gonna happen if I place both of my legs, it's gonna be super difficult to roll it. So, of course, on the other foam rollers, you're gonna have less tension. Okay, I purposely took this one today because I am super sore, always active. We 
we did some crazy hikes yesterday when we had super heavy vests and we did a very steep hike yesterday so my legs are super tight that's why i i gotta stretch more and look if you feel like that your legs get tight and that you feel like the tension and you're not stretched enough you need to do it you need to always stretch there should be never hopping on those sessions or joining those sessions without the warm-up that's why we are so big on getting onto your session on your zoom a little earlier getting ready getting prepared never late okay so keep that in mind that you need to start your session on time now with the facebook obviously if you would start now this is when it's already going you will have to replay from the beginning but make sure that you are stretching that you're giving yourself that time to warm up the muscle and in all different ways why foam rolling it's gonna get that tension out it's like a deep tissue massage i always do this no matter what always stretching always giving myself a time even I have to tell you before the sessions, if I'm not doing in the morning the stretch warm up with you with the stretch drop, I am doing this like 15 to 20 minutes before the session. Never hop with cold legs or cold upper body in onto the session. Always being warmed up, stretched out, especially if you know your body, your body gets really tight. Okay? So now I'm, I'm a foam rolling the calves. Oh yeah, super tight, I have to tell you, super tight. But by doing this, it's gonna get better. Awesome, let's not forget about the inner ties. The inner ties are a lot of times forgotten. How are we gonna warm them up? By going into low plank position, sticking that leg out, and just foam rolling the inner ties. I might be getting some bruise from this, because this is crazy, but that's what the muscle it needs that digging in and stretching and, and releasing that tension because just active stretching sometimes it's not enough okay it's not enough all right roll it roll it roll it and breathe don't hold the breath nice look you can always do more put that foam roller to the side we're gonna get those legs warmed up still with upper body. We're gonna use our stretch strap. If you do not have the stretch strap, you can use a stretch band, the monster band. Look, I'm gonna raise those shoulders up. I want you to bring your leg forward, hold it, hold it, hold it, stretch that band, and see if those shoulders go behind. Because that's important. Bring those arms up, and now bring your other leg forward. Step forward, nice big step forward. Look, I'm bringing my arms up. My arms are actually overhead. What I'm going to do, I'm going to stretch and pull those arms behind. You should be able to do this, okay? This is a full range of motion. That's how your shoulders should be going. So this is actually a test. Let's do this again. Step forward with your left leg. Look, what I'm doing right now, I'm opening up all the hip flexor. By bringing and squeezing my right glute, I'm opening up the right hip flexor stretch right here. Boom. Boom, bring your arms behind, other leg, nice big step forward, breathe out, squeeze your left glute, bring your arms way behind you, yes, how, that's how they should be going, right here, that's your full range of motion, right here, stretch those legs, stretch those arms, a few more times, we're going to use that band, who is with me today, Eliana will be punching, very nice, welcome, reach down towards the floor come up and i want you to bring your shoulders again but this time we're gonna reach down towards the floor exhale yes that's how the shoulders goes in your sockets now not every joint remember will go through such a range of motion we have all these different joints in our body and they all behave differently so let's go out to the side good we're gonna warm up the sides deep breath in is center and exhale is up bring your arms up what i'm doing i'm pulling that stretch gently not too much just enough to have attention okay side to side good now we're gonna do a circle you can bring your hands a little bit closer we're gonna go right 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 and left 
and tension. Left leg, right leg, and tension, up and over. And again, left leg, center, right leg, and up and over one more time. Boom, boom, boom. Good, now other direction, slowly. Don't go fast, I don't want you to get dizzy. Leg should be straight, leg should be shoulder width apart. Nice big rotation right here. Up and over, and again, deep breath in. Exhale when you're going down. Try to reach each time a little bit deeper. No holistic movements, full control. Very good. We're gonna warm up the hips, you ready? Good old stretch. We're gonna start with the circles to the right, especially with boxing, when you're kicking, you should be warming up the hips. Nice, loose. This is the best hip warm up. What you can do now, left. You're gonna go for big shoulder, big rotation. Your shoulders stay still, and you're just doing those big circles. Now we're gonna put our left hand on the left hip, and boom, push it to the right. Now right hand, boom, push it to the left. And again, left to right, yes, and left, right to left. You feel that stretch. Feel that stretch, yes, and again, good. Now we're gonna step forward. We're gonna pull those knees up. Slowly, gently, boom. Breathe out, up, up, and out towards the shoulder. Up and out towards the shoulder. Stepping back, and again, go forward. Bring it up. A little faster now. Just get that balance going. If you cannot do this, you can always hold on to something and do the same exercise, just with the same style, just holding on to that leg. All right. One more time on the hamstrings. I want your legs to be elevated, okay? By pressing against a wall, by pressing against the back of your chair, you're gonna create immediately a stretch. So toes up, up, toes are up. This is called the dorsiflexion position. Reach towards your toes, stand up straight. I want both feet facing the same direction. Reach, you see how I set up that leg? My foot is flat. I don't want that leg to be like this. You will not get that good stretch. I want that heel against that bag or against the wall. Reach and stand up. This is best active stretch for your hamstrings when you have nowhere to go. Literally, nowhere to go. All right, one more time. Now look, what we're gonna do, left leg is up, right leg this direction. We're gonna go sideways to stretch the inner thighs, yes. Going sideways towards that left leg, few times active stretch. Also, not only inner ties and switch. Right leg is up, rotate on your left, hands behind your head, and reaching down with your right elbow to the right knee. Now, inner ties, abductors, right here, that's what's tight, usually from squats and lunges and kicking. Good, and time. Let's do this. We're gonna put our gloves on. If you don't have them, wrap your hands. If you already have your hands wrapped, you are doing jumping jacks in place. Feet only, light on your feet. Light on your feet. Let's do this. I'm putting my gloves on. And we're gonna put the big gloves on. Remember, if you're punching the bag, you should not have your hands just with your gloves. Who is with me, Joseph, hello, second session, nice work, good job. So, especially you, you're doing two sessions a day, you need to double stretch. I just went over foam rolling and stretching, if you're doing double session, your stretching should take more of your time because you exerting the muscle. All right, so listen up. We're gonna start with just going over basic punches, Stay with me, those are actual punches that we're gonna go. You ready? Left leg forward, right leg slightly to the side, elbows should be tucked in, hands protecting the face throughout the whole time. I never come with my feet close. If I rotate, it's always this direction. I never close with my feet. This is the standard stance. One, one, two, let's start. So it's jab, jab, cross, light on your feet. See that reset? Do not punch the back. Uh, there's a full turn, full pivot on that right leg. I'm pausing especially so we can catch that. There you go. And again, one, one, two. Look, proper technique will lead you to power. 
you got to learn that that right leg is turning. Otherwise, you're just throwing a straight on punch. This is a straight punch, but in order to create a force, you got to follow with the breathe and extension of that right arm and pivot on that hip and top. So, light on your feet throughout the whole time. You always rebound, acceleration, snapping, powerful punches. Boom, boom. That's one, one, two. That's jab, jab, cross. Good. We're going over two, two, three. Two, two, three. Perfect setup for that leg hook. You ready? Two, two, three. You see how I'm landing on that right? Ready? Again, two, turn, and look from here. Bam. My right leg is hitting the floor. My left leg is bent. That's how you should feel. It's like a moment of hesitation right there. You get a full support of that right leg. Oh yeah. Again. I'm coming at you. You ready? You better block it if I'm coming at you. Oh yeah. Two, two, three. A few more times. I want you to learn it. To pivot. It's quick. Yes. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Up. One more time. Good. Three, three, four. You ready? Three, three, four. Perfect setup. Love that one. Now, my left leg becomes the support leg after finishing the turn. You see where I finish? Right here. Left leg is there. Again. Three, three, four. Nice. Again. Three. Three, four. And again, non stop motion. Please do not punch yet. Please do not punch yet on the bag or use your dumbbells. This is still shadow box. You gotta get, you gotta get ready. And again, three, three, four. Good. Now four, four, five. Ready? Right hook, right hook, left upper. Yes. Again, boom. Boom, boom. Light on your feet. Four, four, five. Yes. Again. Four, four, five. Four, four, five. Nice work. That's right, right, left. Double right hook. One more, one more. Just by bouncing, I feel my legs. Now five, five, six. I know that you knew that it's coming, right? Five, five, six. Five, five, six. Light on your feet. Five, five, six. Non-stop resetting, non-stop motion, non-stop movement. Five, five, six. Yes, yes, yes. Good work. One more. Good. Alternating toe touches. Hit them for me for a second. Each time you're gonna feel tight, you gotta stretch it. All right, the same motion we're starting on the bed. That was our warm up today. We're starting with one, one, two. I want you to go to a full attack. This is going, this is going, now back, go, go, one, one, two, listen, we're going to have a section of punches, non-stop, then section of bends, non-stop, so get ready, your bends should be at the pole, already prepared for your session, right, and reset, move around that back. Now we're going right into two, two, three. That 10 seconds is for you to loosen up. If you're going all out in those 30 seconds. Two, two, three. Now you know that the right is pivoting, the left is pivoting. Oh yeah. Boom, boom, boom. So we're going straight for punches today. Good work. One extension, left hook is bent, elbow bent, 90 degrees. Again, 
again, listen up. Maybe you want the calves to stretch. Right? Three, three, four, all hooks. Are you with me? Say yeah at home. Say yeah. Scream. Are you with me? Listen, if you want more energy, you gotta expand your energy. That's how it works. So put a little harder into those punches. Punch a little stronger. Breathe out a little better, okay? That's how it works. If you're lazy, moping like this, looking around, it's not gonna work. Four, four, five, let's do this. Feel like a fighter. Punching is awesome. Totally different cardio workout here. for me right here I have a few seconds to take this off unless you're taking something off too I don't know I'm gonna take mine off and remember your body sends you signals of if you are thirsty I am thirsty right now so I'm just gonna chuck some water and you need to too just reminding you performance lowers down 30% get that vent going we are starting with right arm punch. Right arm punch. Left leg is forward. Pay attention. Hand is at the chin. Right here. My left leg is forward. You got this? Now look. Bam. Bam. You're punching it. You're throwing. Down. Down. Turn that hand. Pivot it on the right leg. I want you to go fast. This is not a slow. This should be burning. Fast. Ha! Huh. Right leg forward. Left arm will be punching. Right leg forward. Pay attention. I know that you guys can screw this up. All right? Punch with your left arm. Now your left leg is behind. Your right leg is forward. Yes. Turn. Pivot. This is done fast. There should be not like a super heavy bench. Should be enough resistance. That will tire your shoulder out. The whole entire arm and your breathing. Switch to your right arm. Right arm, look. Now I'm going to roll and twist my left leg with blocking with my left arm. Again, look. Turn your left, twist, block. Raise the elbow. Palm down, palm in. Fast, fast. Twist, twist, twist. Abs, good. Tighten up. So now the same, now I'm gonna roll left, raise my elbow, boom across, blocking, twisting, pivoting on my right 
side, boom, turn, turn. This is your left arm rolling. Raise the elbow, tight, tight, control that band. Say, I'm with you. Come on, scream it. It's not. Do you doing jumping jacks or are you putting your gloves on? It's up to you. I don't know, maybe you're doing a bare fist here. For those of you who will be punching on the bag, you are putting your gloves on. For those of you who do not do that and you just guys have just regular uh, dumbbells, you're doing this too. Oh, Jen, sir. Hello. Welcome back. I hope you're feeling better. Good job showing up. I need to hear from you today. So you better text me or you're going to get blasted with 10,000 messages. Yep. Got it? All right. Listen up. We are going to two, two, one. Now we're going to start with the other side. Left leg forward. Two, two, one. So how are we doing? Boom, boom, boom. And light on your feet. Now, even if you do not have the bag, look, if you're punching with light dumbbells, maybe a bottle of water, whew, that it's filled, like 16 ounces, even the small one, the cup one, it's perfect. I want you, your speed here, okay? Catch that speed. See if you can go that fast. You're gonna be surprised that you haven't been punching hard enough and strong enough and fast enough. One, one, four now. Pay attention to those punches. Light on your feet. Again, jab, jab, right hook. I'm leaning forward that right hook to the back. Okay? Jab doesn't turn, but right hook turns. Elbow is bent on that hook. You gotta lean into it. Transfer that way. It's a weight transfer, remember. Stretch it, those 10 seconds are for you to loosen up. Four, four, three, right hook starts. Four, four, three, know your numbers. Again. if you don't know that. Ha! Huh. All right, let's now. For those of you who are already ready, you're doing jumping jacks, front and back. Front and back, but I want your hands behind your head like this, in a prisoner position. You're doing jacks, and we're gonna get ready for the plank right arm punch. So, your bench should be low. Get ready. Your bench should be low. I am staying in a high plank position. My right arm is right in my face. I'm gonna be punching from that shoulder. 
Got it? Punching from that shoulder, 10 seconds. So keep your feet wider, more stability, three point support right here, and go. Punch it, punch it, right there, right on. We're gonna be going up and down, so get yourself ready. Okay, got it? The next one will be a row to punch. So it's gonna be high one again, and then we're gonna go back to the plank. Because you would not give me a good punch if I would ask you to stay in a hand plank position right now. So that's why the rotation comes to a standing one. This has to all make sense. All right, right on. You ready? Okay, then turn and punch. So look, extend your right arm. Left leg is forward. Don't worry, we might do this again. Left leg, almost it's like a quarter of a lunge. Then you turn, step, and punch. So your left leg is forward now. So again, look slowly. Left leg forward, right arm extended. Stepping back behind me. I'm pulling, I'm rolling that bend in, turning around. 180, punch. Again, let's do this. We're gonna do this faster, I know that you got it. Say, I'm with you. Bam, you better say it. I'm with you, coach. I got it. I will do my best. Boom, bam, bam. Boom, bam, bam. Turn it, it's a 180 turn. Bring the arm towards your rib cage. Punch from that chin. Pivot turn. Ha ha. If you're ready, we'll be able to do the other one. A little bit lower. Left arm punch from the plank position. Where are we? We are right here. Feet are wide. Go. Go. Right elbow slightly bent. You're concentrating on those overhead presses in a high plank position. That elbow slightly bent. Keep your good point of support. Ha, ha. Keep on going. Almost there. When you start shaking, uh, that's a good sign. Uh, left arm higher up. Left arm higher. Left arm, right leg will be going forward. We're gonna turn, you ready? Right leg forward, look, row. Turn to your right, pivot and punch. And again, right leg steps forward, row, turn 180, punch. Go slow, get it. It's forward, right leg forward. I'm turning 180 to your right, turning and punching. So it's just the opposite what we just did. Good job, we're going forward. Put your gloves on. Quickly, I'm gonna reset the clock right now. We are going forward. Now, listen up, sip your water. Quick sip, everybody. Nastrovia, right here. And of course, my herbal tea. You could use double BCA again, but you don't have to. However, you can have about 8,000 milligrams to 9,000 a day, just so you know. All right, just don't give that to your kids. They have much smaller amount, 1,000 milligrams. All right, three, two, one. We are starting with one, one, two, block, two, two, one. So look, we put together the first group and the second group. You ready for this? So look, one, one, two, Block, two, two, one. Ready? Let's do this. I'm gonna always teach you first with this block and then we can go. One, one, two, block, two, two, one. Again, one, one, two, block with your left, two, two, one. Hit the bag. So the reset comes after a full combination. Again, one, one, two, block, two, two, one. One, one, two, block, two, two, one. How are you liking it? One, one, two, block, two, two, one. Block it, lift that elbow up. I want you to pivot. No 
longer round because longer combo. Everything has to make sense. That elbow, the elbow, twist. Light on your feet. Good job. Now listen up. Don't remove your gloves. We're going two, two, three. Block one, one, four. We're putting those together. You ready? Two, two, three. Block with your right arm. One, one, four. You see how we got it? Ready? Two, two, three. Block. One, one, four. Again. Two, two, three. Block. One, one, four. Go for it. Go for it. Again, two, two, three, block, one, one, four, and a turn. Link them together. You gotta sink them, connect them. Boom, boom, boom. This is 
such a good turn. That turn gives you that power for that hook. Turn, power, three, six. Again, four, four, five. Turn, power, three, three, six. Again, four, four, five. Turn, three, three, six. Good job. We're going right into five, five, six. Block body, six, six, five. You ready? So we're starting left, left, right. Block with your left, six, six, five. It led, that, uh, led us all the way to down, down the list, right? All right, five, five, six, block, six, six, five. Go for it. Five, five, six, block, six, six, five. See how my body is dancing from these turns, twists. I'm non-stop turning. Your whole body has to be behind the motion. You cannot be stiff. You have to let the body flow. Do the dance. Yes, it takes years of practice. That's how you gotta practice every day. If you wanna be good, you gotta practice every day. If anything like this in life, things that work for you, if you don't wanna let go of them, you're gonna change, right? So, in order for you to get that down, we gotta practice every day. So don't worry if you cannot get it yet. We're gonna get it by practicing punching every single day. And you can punch with us every single day. Because if you not even do the, the workouts that are written for the weekend, you can always replay any session from the week. Because we have so many sessions, guys. And time. All right. Shake it, loosen up. Because now, we got to put those together. So, we're going into your bands. Now, listen, you did so well, so I know that you're going to do even better. Drink your water. Water is metabolism. That's what the water is. Right on punch, starting on your arm so you just left leg forward you're gonna punch right here i want i want to see it right here i'm in your house i'm looking at you come on joseph jensa eliana how is the punch going if i call your name you better answer answer after not now punch speed 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 Left leg forward, right arm is punching, straight on the chin. Abs tight, so much abs here. Oh. Left arm punch. Right leg forward, left arm right here. You see how I'm turning? I'm pretending that my left leg is the cross. Turn, pivot, heel of the ground. Do it. Few more. Right arm row. Listen up. You're gonna start like this. You're gonna go for speed. Keep on going. Keep on going. And if I'm gonna ask you to reset, then you're gonna reset and do it. Again, just to let you know that this might happen because you never know what's gonna happen over here. We are rowing, it's a speed. Speed right here, bam, bam. Left elbow is up. Pull that elbow in, raise that left elbow up. Shake it, you're going on the opposite arm, right? Now we're going left left arm left arm so again 
Now, left arm rowing, right, right leg is twisting, right elbow goes up. Turn, twist, so much as. Closer the elbow go into that bend, more tension you're getting on those abs. Raise that elbow up, control your arm. You want good abs? Keep them tight throughout your sessions and don't eat crap. Plank right on, plank right on. We are starting in a high plank position. You are going. Right arm is punching. Right arm is punching. Yes, yes, yes. Right arm is punching. Right arm. Are we there? Or what are we doing? Are you guys punching? Are you guys staying in a high plank position a lot? There you go. In a high plank position, feet wide. Straight from that shoulder. Keep that elbow slightly bent. Don't lock it. Take those abs. Few more. And time. You're gonna switch to your left. So you remember that roll and punch. Go up there. So again, right arm. You're gonna step forward with your left, rotate to your left, and then a punch. You got this? Let's do this. Go for it. Go. Right arm, left leg forward. Boom. Turn, punch. Turn, punch. Boom. Turn, punch. Turn and punch. Good work. We gotta go back to our plank position. You know this already, right? That we have to. Almost there. High plank, now left arm will be going. Left arm will be going. Go, go, go. Go right away. Left arm. Hip up, hips are down, hands underneath their shoulder. That bench should not be heavy. Get up, get up. Higher bend, higher bend. I almost did the low one. Higher bend, left arm. Remember. Step forward, right, row and punch. So there is a rowing motion right here. Look, step, turn, punch. I'm not going and twisting myself that I get tangled in that bend. It's a step, row, punch. Step, row, punch. Step, row, punch. Yes, yeah, so much, so much lats here. Oh, this digs in so well. Love it, love it, love it. Good job, everybody. Listen up. Don't think that we are done. Now we gotta go back to our punches. So put your gloves on. Put your gloves on. We're going straight through. One, one, two, 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 three. I'm just gonna call them out. We're not gonna switch anything. We're going straight through. Three, two, one. One, one, two on the back. There is no break from punches right now. Back to the top. One, one, two. Attack it. Turn. That's when your legs will work. Give it turn. Yes. I don't even feel the cold air. No oh, cool air. Can't compare cold to cold. Two, two, three. We still have a beautiful weather. You can just have long sleeves, that's it. But it was chilly when I started. Two, two, three, but I don't feel it anymore. You guys are playing this later. Punch that bag. Break that bag. Hit it hard. 
I want you to release your awesome energy, guys. This is Monday. Monday, amazing things happening. That's how you have to start your week. Three, three, four. I had an amazing day, very productive, because I, I set myself into the productivity mode. I block the time that I'm doing something. Three, three, four. I have an intention of doing my best. No distractions, no phone. And it's not about always thinking, okay, I'm gonna focus more, no. It's not about this. Once you're gonna notice the, the distraction, your focus comes back on automatically. Isn't that amazing? That's what your body does. Four, four, five. Let's do this. Four, four, five. Oh yeah. Four, four, five. That's why you gotta put that phone away. Don't answer your phone if you're not doing if you're doing something important. Do not answer your tasks and then answer when it's time to answer. Five, five, six. And phone can be destruction as we know. So I just want to tell you one thing right now. You're at home and working out. I don't want you to look at the phone, answer the messages, responding to people. Hell no. You shut out that phone. You shut it down. You're not answering nobody. You are doing your workout. Going into two, two, one. Because you know what? If there is an emergency and something happens, much of a chance is that most likely you might not even help. Can't help because maybe you went too far. So then you're gonna deal with it. Attack. Two, two, one. Yes. Good job. Two, two, one. Shake it, one, one, four. I hope that you know these numbers by heart and you're just blasting through them. One, one, four. Attack. Your mindset has to be strong. And by doing exercises, you build that most important muscle is your brain. Of course, the heart. Yes. Four, four, three. So get the deep breath in, four, four, three. Open up, increase the lung capacity through the exercises. Boom, boom, boom. Push it. All these exercises will give you the strength, the power, good thinking, positive thinking. You have a community here of like-minded freaks that support you. You're not feeling alone. This is the worst when you don't have a support system, right? Three, three, six, three, three, six. Let's do this.
You better go. Six, six, five. Cover a lot today. Six, six, five. I'm just gonna be calling switches for you. One, one, two, black, two, two, one, right? Ready? One, one, two, black, two, two, one. Keep on going. One, one, two, black, two, two, one. Again. One, one, two, black, two, two, one. Ready? One, one, two, black, two, two, one. Just do it on your own. You know my my voice is in your head. That's it. something big so you can constantly remind yourself about it three two two three black one one four then you strive for the big goal like big bottle of water you're constantly checking oh i have to drink it i have to drink it by the end of the day two two three black one one four two two three black one one four again two two three black one one four keep on going guys i want to see this keep on going Keep on going. We are pounding. Okay? We are going all out over here. Yes, yes, yes. I'm going to tell you when to switch. I'm going to tell you when to switch, but you're not switching yet. Two, two, three. Black. One, one, four. Black. One, one, four. Again. Lean forward. Two. Two, three, lean, boom, 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 that powerful right hook. Yes, keep on going. Awesome job, again. Two, two, three, black, one, one, four, we put it all together. Pivot, boom, 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 that jab is straight. Hands are up, light on your feet. Keep on going. Don't worry about that, that clock. The clock is not for you. The clock is not for you. Okay? Now, time. We're going three, three, four, black. Four, four, three. I want to see, I want to test you if you can get that block down. So go for it, okay? Let's do this. Three, three, four. You got this? Three, three, four. Block four, four, three. We are pounding. Block to the body. Four, four, three. You better turn and pivot. Don't be stiff on me. Again. Those are final minutes. We still have so much juice left. Yes, you have juice left. And don't worry about the clock. No, no, no. Show me, show me, show me. Three, three, four. Block. Look at that block. Four, four, three. You gotta pivot. You gotta turn. Yes, light on your feet. for it. 
you going for it? You better go for it. You better go for it. You guys are going for it. Four, four, five, black. Three, three, six. Black to the body. Again. Four, four, five, black to the body. Three, three, six. Almost there. Four, four, five, black to the body. Three, three, six. Again. Don't you love these combos? I love them. They are awesome. Intruder. All right. Let's do this. Five, five, six, back to the body. Show me, show me, show me. Five, five, six, back to the body. Six, six, five. Again, show me now. Five, five, six, block to the body. Block it, dig it. Look, raise that elbow, roll the elbow down, raise your hip. Six, six, five. Back, back, back. Five, five, six, block. The head returns towards the chin. Dance with the punches. Block your face. Oh, I missed that block. Five, five, six, block, six, six, five. The head stays up and you're blocking. So you're not lowering down. The whole arm has to be up. my lats. 
Feels good. Oh, I'm attention. I'm looking. I am in your camera. Fine. Bravo. You did it. Can I have Jovic high five? Something? Thumbs up? Thumbs down. Smiley face. Hearts. What else? Crying. Hmm. No, no crying here. You did awesome. You did amazing. This is like a weird glitch always coming through. I see like green stuff coming from the bottom of the screen. But everything is cool. So awesome job today. We continue with our challenge. And listen, if for any reason you did not join the challenge, but you thinking like it's now you are, you, it's time for you, do it. No one is judging you here. You start today. Everybody has a different clock. I know that a lot of you just joined. Some of you joined and never really started. So I want you to take this as a first day. I want you to start today. That's what it is. The first, the first thing you can do in getting into towards your goals is to start. Put an action towards something, even the, if it's small. Jeffrey, how how is that? I never. I mean, I sometimes I see you, but you just popped on the screen and I didn't see you. <laughs> how is that? Okay, Jeffrey, awesome. Thank you so much. So, guys, put an action, and please again. This is the season of giving. Buy someone twenty one days. Give what you need to do. You need to text me and text Eliana and uh, and give us the the person's name, the person the person's email address. I'm gonna put my number here. I know that so many of you are not even on this page or not looking at this page. Just replying these later, but you will see my number. Okay, I am so blind. Two one one nine two five one eight six zero. That's the number that you can text me. And say, so, you know what? I want to purchase for this person. This is the person's name, email address, phone number, and address. And you give the credit card. And we're going to charge for 21 days. Okay? And then you buy a gift for someone. You buy a gift for someone that you care about. Instead of looking for crazy gifts, this is a gift of help. The best gift that you can give to someone. Because people are really suffering right now. They're having a difficult time. And we need to unite our forces and let's do this as a group. So please, today, today, every person, every person from Peak Freak group is giving me one person's name and phone number. And we're going to set them up for the 21 days. All right, deal? Deal. Yes, 21 days for $21. Invite your friends. That's how you invite them. You give them the gift and you tell them, listen, you got to do this. And you remember when I said we're gonna call them and send them a cute message from the center and it's gonna be very unique gifts. Think about it. Have anyone ever sent them anything like this? Probably not. You're gonna be the first one. And that's how you lead. You lead from the front. All right, my friends, thank you so much. Give yourself a round of applause. You did amazing. And if you have any questions, you need support, I want you to text me 201-925-1860. Post your meals on the page. Be engaged in a group. And let's do this together. No excuses.